Speaking of high school football, for decades, when people ask me who has the best high school football field, I've quickly answered Metamora's Malone Field. Assistant coach and groundskeeper Kurt Ryan made sure Metamora's Malone Field was one of, if not the best grass field in the state, but not anymore. Head to Malone Field today and there is no turf. The grass field is gone as Metamora is set to become the fifth middle on high school with a turf field this fall. It's an artificial turf field. It's a little bittersweet, but the artificial turf will provide so much versatility for so many teams and the band at Metamora. I think there's some nostalgia. There always is. There, there was some great, there, there, there's great community pride in our facilities, and obviously Malone Field, uh, as a grass field, uh, was, was very valued, and, and a lot of, uh, you know, awesome memories were made. Uh, we knew with an artificial field, we were going to increase uh, almost daily use. Every day, somebody was going to be on it, regardless of the weather, the temperature, and so um, that really started to kind of swing things. The state champion Metamora Redbirds basketball team will also have a brand new playing surface. The Redbirds shiny new court has an awesome paint job, including a nice tribute to the 2023 state champs. Tepke Jim had a roller coaster year with a flooded warped court, but also a state title team. Now a championship caliber look for the state champion Metamora Redbirds. That is awesome.